Hey, my little farmers, this is Farmer Jason over here at Cog Hill Farm, and I need your guys' help today. I need you to help me feed all other animals here on the farm. So come on, let's go. Oh, boys. Oh, my goodness. Okay, guys, we got a big job to do today. We got to feed the entire farm. So let's see who can get over there the fastest and start feeding these animals. You guys ready? All right. Let's go, come on, Holly. Boys, what are you doing? You gotta come on, let's go. I think Holly won. I think she's the fastest. And the boys, they were a little bit dragging this morning. I need you guys as help today because we have to feed this entire farm this morning. And it is so much fun, but it's a lot of work. So let's go feed all the animals here on the farm and let's see what kind of fun farm adventure we can get into. If you guys have seen some of our previous videos, then you're gonna know it may get a little loud right here because the first farm animals we're fixing to take care of and feed are our two pigs. And that is lovely Loretta and the Gus Butts. But here's the thing about Loretta. Loretta is really loud. Y'all hear her? <laughs> oh my gracious. She's letting me know she is ready to eat breakfast this morning. Good morning, Miss Loretta and Mr. Gus. How are you guys doing today? Oh my. I know you're hungry. I'm fixing to get y'all's breakfast ready right now. Good morning, Gus and Loretta. How are you guys doing this morning? Hmm? All right, there's y'all's breakfast. So all of our animals here on the farm, like our pigs here, Gus and Loretta, all get a special food that is specific to what kind of animal they are. <laughs> Y'all see how quiet Loretta got once she got her breakfast? <laughs> oh, Loretta. Next group of animals we're fixing to go to and feed can get a little crazy sometimes. Y'all come on. So for right now until our new barn gets built, we actually have four different types of animals in this one pasture. And that is our cow, Mildred, our pot belly pig, Peaches, our donkey, Miss Jessie, and of course, our goats. Are you guys ready for some breakfast? Yeah. All right, let's go. First up, Peaches the pig. Good morning, Peaches. There's your breakfast, girl. So this bucket right here and do any of you guys actually know what color this feed bucket is? That's right, it's green. So this green feed bucket here, this is Miss Jessie's bucket, the donkey. So I got Miss Jessie's green feed bowl ready to go. Come on, Jessie. Come on, Jessie. Come on, Jessie. There you go, Jessie. Good girl. Now let's get the goat's feed ready. Come on, goats. Come on, goats. 
I did mention that we did have a cow in here, but it's perfectly okay for Miss Mildred to eat the goat's feet. We got it approved by the vet, but eventually Miss Mildred, when she gets a little bit older, she's going to move into the new pasture with our other cow, Mr. Moody, and then she will be eating strictly cow feed at that time. But boy, y'all, Miss Mildred is a messy eater. She's more messier than the pigs, if you can believe that. <laughs> Miss Mildred almost needs a bib, doesn't she? <laughs> All right, so let's go on down to the next pasture where we have our alarm system, which is our geese, and our emu nugget. Good morning, Nugget. How are you doing, buddy? Are you ready for some breakfast? I bet you are. You want to tell all the little farmers hello this morning? Hello. Hello. All right. And there is the alarm system right behind Nugget, which are our geese. And everybody's waiting for breakfast this morning. So just like our other animals, Nugget, our emu, gets a feed that is specific for him. Now, Nugget is actually part of a group of birds that are flightless that are called ratites, which include other birds such as ostriches and kiwis. All right, Mr. Nugget. Let's get you fed this morning, buddy. All right, geese, you guys are next. All right, y'all, we just got Nugget or Emu fed and our geese, our alarm system fed. So now let's go on to the next pasture right here, which is the boys' pasture. Hey, Mo. Hey, Joe. Hey, Big Moody. Hey, Mr. Moody. Hey, buddy. How you doing, Moo Man? So we're gonna take Moody's bucket here. And do you guys happen to know what color Moody's bucket is? Y'all are too smart. That is right. His bucket is black. All right, Moody, we're coming, buddy. I always like to feed Moody first. Hey, Moody. There you go, buddy. Now let's go feed the boy goats. Good morning, guys. How you guys doing? Look out, buddy. There you go. How's your breakfast, Joe? Pretty good? I give you a little bit more. There you go, partner. Y'all, look who was watching me feed the boys this morning. <laughs> Our friend Nugget. Hey, Nugget. <laughs> He's a very curious bird, I can tell y'all that. Ooh, fun fact about emus from our friend Egypt over there at R. Brown Farmhouse. Hi guys, Egypt here from R. Brown Farmhouse located in Florida, and I'm here with my girl Frankie. Did you know emus love fruits, plants, and insects? Frankie loves grapes. Look, let's see you should take it. Oh, she got it, good girl. Now, how fun was that? Thanks, Egypt and Frankie. So some of y'all may have noticed that you didn't see our littlest buck, Topper. And that's because little Topper hurt his foot yesterday. He actually cut himself right above his hoof. So we cleaned it out and we put some medicine on it and then we put a giant Band-Aid on it. And we also moved another little goat in there as well and that's Bootsy. Do y'all remember Bootsy? She's one of our does and her and Top are big buddies. So we moved Bootsy in there because Top didn't want to be alone. 
because goats are herding animals, which means they do not like to be by themselves. So we didn't want Top to be lonely, so that's why we moved Miss Bootsy over there with him. Let's get them some feed and get them fed this morning as well. And we can check on Mr. Top's foot. Good morning, Top and Bootsy. How are y'all doing this morning? I got you some feed. Yeah, y'all ready? All right, y'all. Here's a little bowl and here's a big bowl. Look here, buddy. Y'all look here. Look, Boots. Now, let me show y'all Topper's big Band-Aid. Y'all see it right there? But it looks like he's putting some weight on it, so I think he's feeling better. Probably in a day or two, we'll move Mr. Topper back over there in the boys' pen or the buck pen, and we'll move Miss Bootsy back over there with the girl goats or the does. Y'all enjoy your breakfast. Next up is our chickens over here in the egg mobile. And do you guys remember what color our egg mobile is? Y'all are the smartest little farmers around. That's right, it's yellow. Good morning, everybody. How y'all doing? Y'all ready for some breakfast? Now, some of y'all may not know about Mr. Cheese, but Cheese is actually our guard goose. And he helps protect our chickens over here from aerial predators such as hawks. And he does an excellent job at it too. So Cheese considers his chickens over here as his really good friends. So he just helps protect them. And mainly is because of his size. Cheese is a really big bird. He is a goose which get fairly large. Fun fact about geese. Geese actually get around three foot tall and can weigh up to 22 pounds. So that makes Cheese a little intimidating to a smaller bird like a hawk. So the chicken's feed has a lot of different ingredients in it. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Hey, Ryan the rooster, how you doing, buddy? Fix and show everybody what your feed looks like. Now this is our chicken feed right here. And look at the ingredients in here. Can you guys spot any ingredients that you know? Well, I'm gonna tell you what I see. I see oats, I see corn, I see peas, and I see sunflower seeds. Along with some pellets. And I'm sure there's something in there that I missed. But regardless, our chickens love it. look at, at all of the different types of chickens we have. They're all different colors, shapes, and have different feather patterns. It's really neat. Here at the fun farm. Here at the fun farm. Here at the fun farm. We got lots of fun. Here at the fun farm. We got lots of fun. We got animals everywhere. Just look around.
how cool is that? And all of the different chickens. See, chickens are just like us. Everyone's different. But you know what? All of us being different is what makes us so special and beautiful. <laughs> Hey Tip, how you doing buddy? Did you, did you enjoy your breakfast this morning? Oh, I know you did, yeah. I know you did. I'm gonna see if everybody else enjoyed their breakfast this morning. I was about to ask Miss Peaches, our big pot belly pig, how did she enjoy breakfast this morning? But y'all look what Peaches is doing. She's taking her a good old nap, isn't she? I guess she enjoyed her breakfast a little too much. <laughs> well, it looks like Miss Jessie and Miss Mildred here didn't have quite enough, so they came over here to get them some good old hay. Didn't you, Miss Jessie? Yeah. See, some of our animals have to have hay as well, and they like to have fresh grass. Oh, Jessie. But let me tell you guys something about Jessie. Jesse also loves hugs. Jesse, you are something else, girl. Yes, you are. You are something else. I guess it's safe to say you enjoyed your breakfast this morning. Yeah. Hey, Fifi. Hey, Paris. Hey, Mildred. How's that hay? Did you hear that rooster? He said, ah, 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 ah. Oh, and Thomas the turkey's over here gobbling. Hey, Miss Loretta. How'd you like breakfast this morning, hmm? What are you and Gus's plans for the day? Y'all gonna be like Miss Peaches and nap all day? Oh goodness, Loretta's got an itch. Look at her. <laughs> it almost looks like she's dancing. Oh goodness, Loretta. Okay, I'll give you a belly rub. Yeah, I'll give you a belly rub, girl. Hey, Gus. I was just giving Miss Loretta a belly rub. You want a belly rub too, buddy? Hmm? You want one too? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mr. Gus wants a belly rub as well. Oh, Gus. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You and Loretta are something else. I guess it's safe to say you enjoyed your breakfast too this morning. Yeah. I cannot thank y'all enough for helping me feed our entire farm today. And I can't wait to see y'all on the next episode. So y'all stay tuned for it and y'all be good.